Kusasang po and hello to you all. Welcome back to my channel, Travel and Food with Kizang. And this blog is actually a continuation of my day trip in Samtsi. Uh, once I reached there, I ordered, I had a quick lunch and I had some other work that I needed to get done. And after that, I wanted to use my time exploring uh, within Samtsi town uh, because I did not have much time. So I will take you around wherever I can, friends, and use my time wisely. Right after lunch, I went to this Shivale Mandir Hindu temple, which I had always wanted to visit, where I had seen in pictures, you know, um, which is located in Samtsi, the very sacred Hindu temple or Shivaji temple, which is located in Samtsi. Uh, Bhutan and uh, it's like few minutes drive from main town so I was just so happy to be there but unfortunately you know it was locked and I was not able to go inside I was quite sad about it you know because I had plans to go there go inside uh, I mean do some meditation for a few minutes and then pray inside but Anyways, you know, friends, uh, since it was locked, so I just decided to, I mean, just uh, hang around the temple and uh, just, you know, from outside uh, and uh, enjoy this beautiful temple for a few minutes. And as the sun was setting, so I thought, you know, the best, uh, best time to spend my time here, uh, just watching the sunset. And that is exactly what I did, friends. And uh, just the feeling of being around here uh, and also, you know, getting to enjoy this beautiful sunset that was just happening. Uh, I felt just so blessed and equally lucky that, you know, that I got to enjoy this, you know, and, uh, and also share with you guys. So friends, if you're ever in Samsi, please, please do visit this Hindu temple, Shivalaya Mandir, and you will have a wonderful experience. The next place that I wanted to visit was, I mean, the new industrial area that is coming up in Samsi. I mean, it's all just under construction right now. There were not much going on, but still then, I just wanted to share with you all. So this is the place where all the offices and uh, small industrial manufacturing units are going to be here in Samtsi in future. just imagining and thinking how beautiful this uh, town is going to look once it's been completed with huge lanes for the vehicle and also everything is segregated you know offices on one side and uh, the industrial area on the other side and uh, hopefully I'll get to visit this town once it's been fully functional and completed and share with you guys also Actually, I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to go
पे तल पर जान पे तल पर जान पे भाई ब्लॉक यो घुम है तल पर तो हो कि फिर यो यो तो छेन यो मत हो सो द ड्राइवर वॉज एक्चुअली ट्राइंग टू टेक मी एक्रॉस दिस इंडस्ट्रियल एरिया टेक अ बाइपास टुवर्ड्स मेन टाउन बट अनफर्चुनेटली द रोड आई हेड वॉज ब्लॉक्ड सो वी हेड टू रिटर्न बैक It was a really nice drive. just um going back to main town and uh, you know i got to see some part of india which actually made me happy you see that wall after that wall actually that is border wall from india and bhutan it's just so close by and yet you know like uh, just due to covid we are not allowed to go cross that uh, border and if you do then you will have to stay in quarantine for two weeks as of now so nobody wants to go there and come back and stay in quarantine so that's the beautiful india side you get to see it So friends like anything else if there's a beginning we know there is going to be an end and I'm really sad to say this but you know I'm uh, I'm feeling quite emotional leaving Samsi back because I had a I mean even though it was a short visit I had an awesome time here a lot of memories that I will you know always remember and I hope you guys felt the same and uh, and hopefully i get to you know share with you all the beautiful sunset that is actually happening right now from the mount i mean uh, from the hill top and especially from you know that numlakha view point so i hope i get to share with you guys
here is the beautiful sunset view from Numlaka viewpoint. It's absolutely gorgeous and I just feel like I can just hold on to this time and enjoy this forever. Friends, I end my blog here for today and I'm going to enjoy this delicious iced coffee and some pastries. And if you're ever in Funsiling, please do visit this bakery known as Zomla Bakery, which is located in the heart of Funsiling town and where you can order your customized cake for all your celebrations and delicious pastries. And thank you for watching, friends. Please do share lots of love, happiness and peace to all.